I thought I'd show you the sensor um, on here and you probably need to keep it clean as well. Um, I went ahead and used my shop vac and vacuumed out most of the ashes that were in there so that it's all clean now. Uh, but more importantly, if you have trouble over time uh, with your pit boss, and this could be true for Traeger and other brands as well, uh, you kind of want to make sure the temperature sensor is clean because you're going to get gunk and grease on it. And that can cause your temperature to uh, not be as accurate or have more fluctuations. So uh, right here, as you can see, I've got it all pretty well cleaned up. Uh, maybe a little bit in there. It's not perfect. Uh, yeah, it could use a little more detailing, but we got most of the ashes out with the shop back. But right here is a little sensor, if I can get the uh, camera where I want it. Right here is actually a little sensor. And you want to keep that clean. Now, you can just use a uh, some alcohol and a tissue or something, but I've actually got just uh, some... Uh, little alcohol prep pads and I've now got it out of the package and I'm just going to go ahead and uh, put it on here and just kind of rub it this does have a little protective cover on it to keep things from getting to it uh, but you can see uh, how the dirt that's coming off of it and I can get down in there pretty good I don't want to take that piece off I'm just going to kind of rub that around real good so there you have it uh, keep your sensors clean uh, on your uh, pellet grills of course check with your manufacturer and all that uh, and for their recommendations. Um, just want to be careful when you do it. Just don't put too much pressure on the sensor. Just gently wipe it off. You could even just use a little soap and water. Just gentle. Don't You don't want to break it because uh, you could. So just gentle. Be gentle with it and, and keep it clean. I've got another video coming out this Thursday. I'm going to go ahead and pull out the pit barrel. So why don't you join me then?